Psalms chapter 51 verses 10. Create in me a clean heart, O God. Renew a right spirit within me. See, he, first David said, create in me a clean heart. You know, the Bible says our heart is deceitfully weak. So how he creates a clean heart? When he renews the right spirit within me. What is the right spirit? The right spirit is the Holy Spirit. The right spirit is the Holy Ghost. Ezekiel chapter 36 verses 26. He said, I will give you a new heart. I will put a new spirit within you. I will take out the heart of stone of your flesh and give you a heart of flesh. He said, I'll, when you get the Holy Ghost, God is putting a new heart in you. You know that? He said, he's taking out that heart of stone, that cold heart, that heart that's so careless, that uncaring heart. And he's giving you a heart of flesh, a heart of compassion, a heart for the things of God. And you see, once you get the Holy Ghost, in uh, 2 Corinthians chapter 5, verses 17, if anyone is in Christ, if anyone that has the Holy Ghost, he's a new creation. The new creation has come, and the old is gone, and the new is here. You are new. You are renewed in the Lord. So you're a new creation. You're a new person. The old person's dead. The old person, he died in that watery grave. He died in that water baptism in Jesus' name. In which the Bible said you are to be baptized in the name of Jesus. So the old is dead. In Acts chapter 2, verses 38, Peter said, Repent, get baptized, everyone, you in the name of Jesus Christ for the forgiveness of your sins. You shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. Again, that's how, that's the formula of becoming a new creation in Christ. That is the formula of becoming, having that new spirit and having that spirit renewed. You know, see, that's the thing. First thing, you got to repent. You got to turn away. You, that, old, that old person has to die. And you got to get baptized in Jesus' name. Again, that old person has to die. And you get the Holy Ghost. And you get the eternal gift from God. 